This is the fastball, then off-speed alternating drill. So I'm going to throw him the first pitch a fastball. The second pitch will be a curveball. We're going to alternate that back and forth throughout this whole entire drill. If I throw a ball for whatever reason, I'm going to go ahead and go straight to the next next uh, pitch. If I throw him a ball and a curveball, for instance, we'll go straight to a fastball. That way we keep the rotation consistent. That way he knows what pitch is coming. That way as an instructor, as the tosser, you don't get confused on what you need to throw. So you, no matter what, no matter what the pitch is, fastball, then off speed, you're staying in that consistent basis so you're on the same page. Goal of this drill, we're always sitting fastball as a hitter. There are certain times to sit curveball, but that is, we're saving that for level two in the advanced program because right now we're trying to sit fastball, see fastball, and hit fastball. Do not miss the fastball. If you miss the fastball and you're at bat, you're going to be pretty much done. Very rarely do you get another fastball when you're facing good competition that you can hammer. If you do, you better not miss that second one. So what we're trying to do here is he's sitting that fastball, then he's going to adjust to that curveball consistently. Okay? Here we go. Fastball. notice here he's sitting fastball every time when you're sitting fastball you have to adjust to that curveball with your upper half as a coach and instructor and as a former player I would get ticked off all the time when coach would say well stay back on the off-speed pitch well yeah and the sky's blue everybody knows that but we're gonna get fooled okay so when we get fooled we have to make the adjustments with the upper half he's got to keep his tension in his, his backside he's got to keep the tension in his hands to not allow his hands to commit, because when your hands commit to the ball, that's when you're done. You're trying to stay back and make those adjustments. Also notice he's controlling his center of gravity on the fastballs. When he gets fooled on curveballs or the ball's moving, he's got to change his center of gravity and his balance and make the adjustment. Boom, he might fall toward that ball a little bit, but he's controlling his core, core stability in his swing, and he's controlling his balance to adjust to that pitch away. Boom, he gets that, he stays on that baseball. You see MLB hitters and big leaguers do it all the time. You've got to adjust from pitch to pitch, change your center of gravity. You might have to change your center of gravity at the waist to get that pitch to stay alive on an 0-2 curveball. That right there is the fastball off-speed alternating screen toss drill.